Hibiscus, Wikipedia Audio 679 Species Hibiscus is a genus of flowering plants in the Mallow family, Malvaceae. The genus is quite large, comprising several hundred species that are native to warm temperate, subtropical and tropical regions throughout the world. Member species are renowned for their large, showy flowers and those species are commonly known simply as hibiscus, or less widely known as rose mallow. The genus includes both annual and perennial herbaceous plants, as well as woody shrubs and small trees. The generic name is derived from the Greek name Pedaneus dios chorids gave to Althea officinalis. Description Several species are widely cultivated as ornamental plants, notably Hibiscus syriacus and Hibiscus rosa sinensis. A tea made from hibiscus flowers is known by many names around the world and is served both hot and cold. The beverage is known for its red color, tart flavor, and vitamin C content. The leaves are alternate, ovate to lanceolate, often with a toothed or lobed margin. The flowers are large, conspicuous, trumpet-shaped, with five or more petals, color from white to pink, red, orange, peach, yellow or purple, and from 418 cm broad. Flower color in certain species, such as H. mutabilis and H. tiliaceus, changes with age. The fruit is a dry five-lobed capsule, containing several seeds in each lobe, which are released when the capsule dehisces at maturity. It is of red and white colors. It is an example of complete flowers. The hibiscus is a national symbol of Haiti and the national flower of nations including the Solomon Islands and Niu. Hibiscus syriacus is the national flower of South Korea, and hibiscus rosa sinensis is the national flower of Malaysia. The red hibiscus is the flower of the Hindu goddess Kali and appears frequently in depictions of her in the art of Bengal, India, often with the goddess and the flower merging in form. The hibiscus is used as an offering to goddess Kali and Lord Ganesha in Hindu worship. In the Philippines, the gumamela is used by children as part of a bubble-making pastime. The flowers and leaves are crushed until the sticky juices come out. Hollow papaya stalks are then dipped into this and used as straws for blowing bubbles. Together with soap, hibiscus juices produce more bubbles. The hibiscus flower is traditionally worn by Tahitian and Hawaiian girls. If the flower is worn behind the left ear, the woman is married or in a relationship. If the flower is worn on the right, she is single or openly available for a relationship. The hibiscus is Hawaii's state flower. Nigerian author Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie named her first novel Purple Hibiscus after the delicate flower. The bark of the hibiscus contains strong bast fibers that can be obtained by letting the stripped bark set in the sea to let the organic material rot away. Many species are grown for their showy flowers or used as landscape shrubs, and are used to attract butterflies, bees, and hummingbirds. Hibiscus Flowers Life Cycle Stages Hibiscus is a very hardy, versatile plant and in tropical conditions it can enhance the beauty of any garden. Being versatile it adapts itself easily to balcony gardens in crammed urban spaces and can be easily grown in pots as a creeper or even in hanging pots. It is a perennial and flowers through the year. As it comes in a variety of colors, it's a plant which can add vibrancy to any garden. The only infestation that gardeners need to be vigilant about is mealybug. Mealybug infestations are easy to spot as it's clearly visible as a distinct white cottony infestation on buds, leaves, or even stems. 
To protect the plant you need to trim away the infected part, spray with water, and apply an appropriate pesticide. One species of hibiscus, known as canaf, is extensively used in paper making. The tea made of hibiscus flowers is known by many names in many countries around the world and is served both hot and cold. The beverage is well known for its red color, tartness, and unique flavor. Additionally, it is highly nutritious because of its vitamin C content. It is known as basup in West Africa, Gul e Katmai in Urdu and Persian, Agua de Jamaica in Mexico and Central America and Orhul in India. Some refer to it as Roselle, a common name for the hibiscus flower. In Jamaica, Trinidad, and many other islands in the Caribbean, the drink is known as sorrel. In Ghana, the drink is known as sobolo in one of the local languages. In Cambodia, a cold beverage can be prepared by first steeping the petals in hot water until the colors are leached from the petals, then adding lime juice, sweeteners, and finally cold water slash ice cubes. In Egypt, Sudan, and the Arab world, hibiscus tea is known as carcade, and is served as both a hot and a cold drink. Uses Symbolism and Culture Dried hibiscus is edible, and it is often a delicacy in Mexico. It can also be candied and used as a garnish, usually for desserts. Landscaping Paper Beverage Food Folk medicine The roselle is used as a vegetable. The species Hibiscus serotensis lin synonymous to Hibiscus aculeatus g don is noted in Visayas in the Philippines as being a souring ingredient for almost all local vegetables and menus. Known as labog in the Visayan area, the species is an ingredient in cooking native chicken soup. Hibiscus species are used as food plants by the larvae of some Lepidopteran species, including Chionodes hibiscilla, Hypercomp hambletoni, the nutmeg moth, and the turnip moth. Hibiscus rosa sinensis is described as having a number of medical uses in Chinese herbology. Claimed Effects on Blood Pressure It has been claimed that sour teas derived from hibiscus sabdarifa may lower blood pressure. While the mechanism is not well understood, previous animal studies have demonstrated both an inhibitory effect of H. sabdarifa on muscle tone and the anti-fertility effects of hibiscus rosa sinensis, respectively. The extract of H. sabdarifa has been shown to stimulate contraction of the rat bladder and uterus. The H. rosa sinensis extract has exhibited contraceptive effects in the form of estrogen activity in rats. These findings have not been observed in humans. The hibiscus rosa sinensis is also thought to have amenagogue effects which can stimulate menstruation and, in some women, cause an abortion. Due to the documented adverse effects in animal studies and the reported pharmacological properties, the H. sabdarifa and H. rosa sinensis are not recommended for use during pregnancy. Additionally, they are not recommended while breastfeeding due to the lack of reliable information on its safety and use. It is postulated that H. sabdarifa interacts with diclofenac, chloroquine, and acetaminophen by altering the pharmacokinetics. In healthy human volunteers, the H. sabdarifa extract was found to reduce the excretion of diclofenac upon CO administration. Additionally, CO administration of carcade, a common Sudanese beverage, was found to reduce chloroquine bioavailability. However, no statistically significant changes were observed in the pharmacokinetics of acetaminophen when administered with the Zobo drink.
further studies are needed to demonstrate clinical significance. In temperate zones, probably the most commonly grown ornamental species is Hibiscus syriacus, the common garden hibiscus, also known in some areas as the Rose of Althea or Rose of Sharon. In tropical and subtropical areas, the Chinese hibiscus, with its many showy hybrids, is the most popular hibiscus. Several hundred species are known, including Precautions and contraindications Pregnancy and lactation Drug interactions Species Formerly placed here